What are you guys doing here? Oh, it's you guys. Well, <laughs> good morning, everybody. Welcome back to more Let's Play Human Nikki on Nuclear Gothic. Oops, that was totally the wrong button to press. Excuse me a sec. <laughs> well, good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the correct Let's Play Human Nikki on Nuclear Gothic. Where we last left off, we were Matatsuki, and we got some nice stuff. So. Okay, so I was told what the kitty kitty cat head does. TV still doesn't work. And I doubt that playing, um, what's it called? Nazo? Nazu? Uh, will do anything for me. Hmm. Anything different on the telly? Nay. Can we save game in our dream? Oh no, but we can sit down. <gasps> I would do this in my chair for hours. Oh man. But anyway, it is time to go into the door room. All right, I was finally told what the point of dropping stuff is in the door room, but for now, it's not important. For now. Let us just venture onwards into doors, doors into dreams. Ah, I was told about this room uh, today. Uh, it's completely black, and these puddles are reflections of the sky. Now, see, um, from what I was told, and I'm gonna go on a bit of breaking the uh, fourth wall here, is the game. Huh, still doesn't help. Ooh, it makes different sound effects when you step in the puddles. That's cool. Now, from ex uh, from other experiences, there are some rooms in this game that can make you actually feel certain emotions. This one, for example, has been known to bring about a, uh, a sadness sort of uh, feeling. And... Upon talking about this room, actually, uh, hey, that's a good landmark. Let's. <laughs> it's my bro. Let's go ahead and uh, turn. Oh, uh, when we were talking about this room, uh, it, it was kind of like, wow, it's really dark and depressing and really moody, and it's kind of like there's no hope, and all you want to do is look up at the sky, but that's just the thing, is you can't look up at it and also um, there is kind of point to uh, things like the flute and that it would make rooms like this a lot less uh, well a lot less you know depressing uh, the flute is really made in the game to make you feel better about stuff and it does, you know, as soon as I got it, I was absolutely ecstatic to have it and walk around with this thing. That's really cool. It's not that the flute in the game or the frog head directly affect anything in the game, as much as it does affect the player directly. That kind of thing makes me go, holy crap, that's absolutely brilliant. More games should do this. I sure hope I'm not going to get hit by a car. It's funny that that was the first door I walk into after it was the last room that I talked about today to, uh, to other people. Sorry if I'm quiet, I just... <laughs> I don't... Remember what I said about rooms conveying emotion? There's definitely a lot of emotion to be felt in here. And it's probably why I'm playing the flute so much, because I don't want to get consumed by the emotion. I'm trying to, you know, keep a keep a lighthearted feel to it. Gotta gotta keep playing that flute. Gotta keep ruining the mood. Gotta ruin the mood. Just don't forget to stop. Don't forget to stop. Don't forget to keep playing the flute there, girl. 
You look out of place. Hmm, anything I can do here? What does the demon do? It became a demon. <gasps> Whoa! She makes lightning. She really does, huh? That's cool. And she stops while she does it. Okay, I just don't want to spam that. Hmm, what can lightning be useful for? What else do we have? Cat. The point of the cat is to beckon NPCs closer to you. So, you know, like, the girls that were running? I can only assume that the cat, um, going like... Going like that makes them attracted to you or something, and they, they become less afraid to approach you. Oh my gosh, excuse me. Don't mind me, I'm just a cute little cat girl lost in the forest. In a skirt. I hope no one's going to find me out here. No tall slender men. In black suits and ties. Uh, what are you? Do you like frogs? Okay, do you like lamps? Okay, do you like demons? Nope, okay. It's just, it's just things. It's just things in the game. This is just average Dan Yumi Nikki Land. I was told uh, also to watch a certain video once I was done with this game, uh, and no, no spoilers were given to me at all. Hey, what are you doing right there? I really want to examine everything, but I know that Yumi Nikki, I mean Metatsuki, isn't going to. Just, I think the demon has got to be one of my favorite forms. I really wish that I could command thunder. That'd be awesome. I would make it thunder all the time. I love thunder. And I love rainstorms. Big hurricanes. and I love... The only good thing about summers here in Florida land is... Uh, is the amount of storms that we get. And that's about it. I love all the hurricanes. and Just everything that they do. There needs to be a sprinting effect. Please tell me that we're going to find some track shoes later on in this game. Are we going in circles? I feel like I'm in a... I'm in a I feel like I'm in a Hanna-Barbera cartoon at this point. I know we're just going in circles now. Uh... Yup. Hey! That thing looked at me. Don't think I didn't see that. Don't mind me. Just a little demon girl. Hey, this place looks all new. Did we did we go back in the past? Samurai Jack. What are you? Okay. Hey, don't look at me. We climbed the tentacles. Someone forgot to color in this part of the game. Hello? Um... <laughs> I love this game! This game is really, really interesting. I think all you Nikki and you Nikki likes are... Interesting. This thing reminds me of a monster from friggin' uh, what was that game called? Um, Heart of Darkness? It was an old PlayStation 1 game and it was hard, hard, hard! Man, was Heart of Darkness a hard game. But it was supposed to be hard. If only I had some sort of knife! We can't walk around this thing. Hey, that guy's got a nosebleed, I just noticed. 
Oh uh, man, there's really, really nothing we can do here. Okay. Back into the nosebleed. We gotta find something before this episode's over. How did she climb up those? She's a lot more athletic than I am. I mean, she's so... she's so B.A. she can climb those with her eyes closed! What a boss! Oh, no, he's dead. Oh, we got a stoplight. Okay. What? Really? Be I... I became a stoplight. Don't come any close. <gasps> we can play red light, green light with stuff now. Red light! Green light. Can we go around these? Nope. What is the point of the red light, green light? <gasps> oh, I bet we might need this for the drawing of the toothy creature. Maybe. I don't know. I'm just <laughs> banging rocks together again. This is what these games are. Hey! Green light. Red light. Green light! Oh! Hey! Yeah! What? Look! When I red light, the thing stops. When I green light, it goes again. But why is this important? Why? <laughs> it doesn't affect anything. I don't, I don't get it, frankly, quite frankly. Maybe we do need a knife, and they need to work together. Oh, we can't wake up with an effect. Uh, oh. Now, wake up. Good morning, world, and all who inhabit it. stoplight. What the? Whoa, 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 I didn't- What did I just do? What? What? Oh, wait. Whoa. Oh. 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 I hate this channel. But no, no. Wait a sec. Why did that happen? What? What in the world was that? I became a cat. What? No, 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 no. What was with the Australian channel? Is that just for the stoplight? Yeah, what the boop? Okay, alright, wait, 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 wait. What if we stop? What? I don't... Never mind. Craziest friggin... I don't even know... What I'm... Game. Hey! I know what this room is! You don't even know how close we are to the knife right now. You don't even... Know! How close we are to the knife right now. Do you know? Do you have any idea how close we are to the knife right now? We're so close. We're so close that you don't even know. Hey, come back. I don't even know how close we are to the knife right now is how much that you don't know how close we are to the knife right now. Did that even make- See, I told you, you had no idea, did you? This is mine, this is my knife, and you will help me grab my knife. What? Look at these hands. It's like hands-free knife. 
I think that's really all we need here. We got our lamp. And we got our knife. And you, my good man, are about to get stabbed. What? She just switches hands. What? No, no. That's not- Hey, where'd it go? Uh, okay, wake up real fast. Just to have easy access out. I don't even- TV, please. I've had enough of you. I'm going to bed. Wake me up when September ends. Hey! The background changed. Also, we now have a knife. I am right-handed, so I'll hold it like this. Hey, what happens if we turn on the TV now? Nothing. Don't run with knives, kids. It's not a good idea. At all. Oh, 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 okay. Uh. Stabby, stabby. Let's just go this way. Alright. Here's a candle. Oh. There's more can- Uh. 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 Okay. Alright. Here's more candles. Two of them. Two candles. Two cool can- Cool cat candles. Two more cool cat candles. Alrighty. Two more cool cat candles. I got a bad feeling that we're just going in circles. If I find two more cool cat candles, then I don't think that we're going anywhere at all. Wait, 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 wait. Red light. <laughs> that is hella helpful. Holy crap. <gasps> we can become a midget? Oh, I'm baby reset! I mean, reset? No, wrong game. Baby Metatsuki. You all are about to get stabbed in the face. Come back here, it's no fun poking you in the bum. What is going on? If Madatsuki went to a psychiatrist, what do you think he would say about her? So, have you had any strange dreams lately? Let me tell you about my dreams. I see... Doors. We've been in here before. I don't remember what's in there, where it goes, so we'll just look in other doors now. I think I broke the game. Oh my god, but everything squeaks when you touch it. I'm in a much happier room. Except for that in the background. Screw the path. Actually, have you guys heard of a game called The Path? It's sort of like a uh, Little Red Riding Hood based story. Or independent game. And uh, I don't know that very much about it, but it's kind of like there's a path to Grandma's house, and you can follow the path directly, or you can go off the path, quite literally, into the woods, and I think that the girls that you play as can make a... Hey, it's a hand. Is this a body? Can make, like, their own little tents and do their clothes and stuff, and it's just sort of like wandering and seeing what's off the beaten path of life. And... I don't know, the concept sounds really cool to me. I never did get to play it beyond the demo, and the demo doesn't even represent anything from the actual game at all. So I can't even judge the real game for what it might truly be. But that game is really old, like it's been on Steam for years now. I still haven't gotten the chance to to buy it or anything. Okay, don't know what was up with that. 
try this door. No, we still haven't seen Ubua. How could it that my white friend would be like, Oh, Ubua was the first thing I saw in this game. How? We've been in like almost all the doors now. Have you seen Ubua? No, I haven't. Seen some other freaky deaky things, but not that. Uh. Whoa. Alright, you. Prepare to be stabbed. Come back. Come on. Can I not stab it? Can I get it? Ooh! Oh, I got- Oh, you just walk into things to stab them. Oh. Well. That's good to know. Alright, you. Come back here. Come. No wonder they're, like, running from me, because... Friggin' Madatsuki's chasing them with a big kitchen knife. As long as her friggin' arms. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Stab it in the back! Or go down the sewer. Hey, what is this? Where's this go to? Even Yume Nikki isn't safe from the obligatory sewer levels. Just when you thought Miserari was the last one. Oh, it's a slime from Dragon Quest. Stab it, Matatsuki. Oh. Come on, stab it harder. Okay. Wait, maybe if we change hands. I don't know. Okay, uh... Do you like midgets? Ooh. Oh no no no! Oh no no no! How many times can we? Oh my God! Oh no no no! Puri puri! Puri 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 puri! <laughs> this is the best game. Maybe I can beckon the slime. Hey, Slime, don't you want a piece of this? Huh? You want some hot Neko action? No? How about... Thund! What? Oh, I see. Oh, she goes putty if uh, nothing works. She obviously wants flan if nothing else. Alright, no, no reason to freeze time, I guess. Uh, we can't really jump over it. Or can we go in the water? I almost thought the frog would be helpful like that. Maybe he wants some tunes. Nope. Nope. Well, I don't get it, but I'm sure there's something eventually. Also, I found that the stab button is enter, so I've been going at it all wrong this whole time. Well, it's it's been like... Press 1 to use the effect. Forever. And when I have a knife, pressing one just switches hands. What was that? Oh. Oh. Alright, time to stab it. Good job, Matatsuki. Ten experience points. <gasps> Graffiti! Time to stab it! I don't know what you do with graffiti. Wash it? You can't look at it. I don't think any of my effects would do anything to that. <gasps> Another one. There we go. Plus 10 EXP. Hello? Ooh. 
What's in here? Hello! <gasps> Is that a hole? Like a mouse hole? Can I midget my way in there? Hi! Nope. Uh, Tim Schafer, stop it. I don't like that thing. It looks like a Shadow Lord from Ultima 5. Nick, stop. Stop comparing everything to Ultima. What the? Oh, I, I cannot stab the Shadow Lord. I bet I can midget through there. Heck yes! I knew the midget would be helpful. What is with these? Anyone else got a bad feeling about this? Huh. Well, whatever they are, I can't do anything to them. They she just putties. Putty putty. Giga putty. <gasps> A sea serpent. Stop it. If only I had some sort of effect. To make me fly over there. I don't know. We've gone way over time, but I know that I've cut footage, so. Like, I don't know how long it's been for you guys, but I've been going for over half an hour over here. I just want to see what's gonna happen. It's a, a more Dragon Quest monsters. What is this? These ducks. These ducks better. Who are you? Whoever you are, you're dead now. Oh my god! Matatsuki, what is wrong with you? But we have a knife. So we can do a lot now. The real world just never changes, does it? No, it doesn't. Oh, Matsuki. Time to write about how crazy we are. Mein Kampf, Chapter 6. Alright. Alright, everybody. Thank you all so very much for watching more Let's Play. Hang on, I want to look at these real fast. Just because. No particular reason. Okay. Thank you all so much for watching another episode of Let's Play Yuma Nikki on Nuclear Gothic. Hope you guys enjoyed. I hope it didn't take too long. And uh, that's pretty much it. So I hope that you guys will uh, stick around for whatever I decide to. Matatsuki, did you fall asleep? Whatever I decide to film after this. Matatsuki! Wake up! Good girl. Alright. So obedient. <laughs> Sit. If I ever said that to a real girl, I would get my head bit off. But, until next time, does Vadanya. Maratsuki, sleep. Good girl.
and it does, you know, as soon as I got it, I was absolutely ecstatic to have it and walk around with this thing. That's really cool. It's not that the flute in the game or the frog head directly affect anything in the game, as much as it does affect the player directly. That kind of thing makes me go, holy crap, that's absolutely brilliant, more games should do this. I sure hope I'm not going to get hit by a car. It's funny that that was the first door I walk into after it was the last room that I talked about today to, uh, to other people. Sorry if I'm quiet, I just... <laughs> I don't... Remember what I said about rooms conveying emotion? There's definitely- Hey! What are you guys doing here? Oh! It's you guys! Well, hey. <laughs> good morning, everybody. Welcome back to more Let's Play Humaniki on Nuclear Gothic. Oops! That was totally the wrong button to press. Excuse me a sec. Well, good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the correct Let's Play Yumi Nikki on Nuclear Gothic, where we last left off, we were Maratsuki, and we got some nice stuff. So, okay, so I was told what the kitty kitty cat head does. TV still doesn't work, and I doubt that playing, um, what was it called? Nazo? Nazu? Uh, will do anything for me. Hmm. Anything different on the telly? Nay. Can we save game in our dream? Oh no, but we could sit down. <gasps> I would do this in my chair for hours. Oh man. But anyway. It is time to go into the door room. All right, I was finally told what the uh, point of dropping stuff is in the door room, but for now, it's not important. For now, let us just venture onwards into doors, doors into dreams. Ah, I was told about this room uh, today. Uh, it's completely black, and these puddles are reflections of the sky. Now, see, um, from what I was told, and I'm gonna go on a bit of breaking the uh, fourth wall here, is the game... Huh, still doesn't help. Ooh, it makes different sound effects when you step in the puddles, that's cool. Now, from, ex uh, from other experiences, there are some rooms in this game that can make you actually feel certain emotions. This one, for example, has been known to bring about a, uh, a sadness sort of uh, feeling. And upon talking about this room, actually, uh, hey, that's a good landmark. Let's. <laughs> it's my bro. Let's go ahead and uh, turn. Oh, uh, when we were talking about this room, uh, it, it was kind of like, wow, it's really dark and depressing and really moody, and it's kind of like there's no hope, and all you want to do is look up at the sky, but that's just the thing, is you can't look up at it. And also, um, there is kind of point to uh, things like the flute, and that it would make rooms like this a lot less, uh... Well... A lot less, you know, depressing. Uh, the flute is really made in the game to make you feel better about stuff. Really a lot of emotion to be felt in here. And it's probably why I'm playing the flute so much, because I don't want to get consumed by the emotion. Trying to, you know, keep a keep a lighthearted feel to it. Gotta gotta keep playing that flute. Gotta keep ruining the mood. Gotta ruin the mood. Just don't forget to stop. Don't forget to stop. Don't forget to keep playing the flute, there, girl. 
You look out of place. Hmm, anything I can do here? What does the demon do? It became a demon. <gasps> Whoa! She makes lightning. She really does, huh? That's cool. And she stops while she does it. Okay, I don't want to spam that. Hmm, what can lightning be useful for? What else do we have? Cat. The point of the cat is to beckon NPCs closer to you. So, you know like the girls that were running?